my life over again. I'd let you have your Elvina. Mm. And everything else you'd get with it, too. Well, if I had my life to live over again, I'd go after the dough. That's what I'd do. Get myself some real happiness. <laughs> This ain't me, see? What? I say, this ain't me, I'm telling you. I live in New York, and I'm 44 years old. I used to live here until I moved away 20 years ago. Your fair face beams. Your fair face beams. What's the matter with you? What's, what's the idea of singing all them old songs? What do you want us to sing? Sing something lively. Something that's got some life in it. Like Tony's wife. Tony's, Tony's wife. wife? Yeah. Tony's wife. Tony's wife. Tony's wife. Tony's wife. Tony's wife. This ain't me, I tell you. I've been married before and my wife don't appreciate me. <laughs> So you've been two-timing me, huh? What are you talking about? Listen, baby, I'm no Ted Wright. I know what I've been made a sucker of. Well, I've been talking to the President of the United States. What have you been doing? Oh, don't be ridiculous. You don't know tell I... me I know. Trying to put one over on me, huh? Well, I don't see what that's got to do with us. You don't, huh? Man alive, that is probably the most important piece in the newspaper that you've ever read in your entire life. There's going to be a war, and this shooting here is what's going to set off the whole powder mine. <laughs> so you're now a student of foreign affairs, are you? <laughs> student, nothing, I'm a graduate. I don't need any vision to know what's going to happen to me. I ain't going to take the rap for anybody. Not me. Not Joe Gimlet. Oh, no, they'll never get me. I resign. <laughs> 